Where are we going to today, Deanna? Bear Mountain Reservation in Connecticut. All right, let's go. Well, we made it to Bear Mountain Reservation in Connecticut, not to be confused with Bear Mountain in New York. And this is the first time I'm testing out my gimbal. So we'll see how smooth action this thing is today. <laughs> so we are the only ones here today. <laughs> no one in the parking lot, but it is about, what, 10 degrees outside right now? Yeah. Something like that. We are at Bear Mountain Reservation and we're about right here. And we're gonna, I think we're gonna probably take this red trail and maybe wrap that around for a loop and see where we go from there. But it looks like the peak's over there, so we might head over there too. I guess we'll find out. See how bad these trails are, condition-wise. So it is definitely a, a cold day out here. How you doing, Deanna? Chilly. Chilly? <laughs> We're still only on the red trail making our way back. Not really sure how far back this goes or how long the trails are. I guess I need to look at my map again to see. I didn't put my yak tracks on today, but I think I might have to do that. It's getting a little slippery out here. Cool little metal area through here. There's a ton of bird feeders and <laughs> I'm sure the birds are, not bird feeders, sorry. There's tons of bird houses out here. And I'm sure the birds are happy in the winter time for that. So these trails are actually fairly well marked. We're not having any trouble finding our way here in the winter time. Plus it looks like there's some people that already hiked through here, so that always helps as well. So we're gonna be heading up there. Wish us luck. This violet trail is definitely a workout. So I would say this is a moderate to difficult trail going up to the peak here. So this isn't even the peak, but since all these leaves are down on these trees, you can see the cool mountains off in the background over there. It's a very beautiful area in the winter time. If that's not well marked, I don't know what is. <laughs> very easy to see, and we're gonna be taking this yellow trail up to go to the peak of this mountain, or the park at least. You probably can't see it too well on the GoPro, but you can actually see Candlewood Lake down here through the trees. So I'm making our way forward. I don't see too much more of an elevation gain, so I'm thinking we're about to the peak. I don't know if you can see the deer running away or not. Might have to zoom in on that. So unfortunately, I think the GoPro's battery is about to die, so <laughs> might be a little short on footage during this video. Definitely steep going down this violet trail. Maybe not a wise idea in the winter time. The gimbal's probably not even showing you that I'm sliding right now. I had to put the mask on. My face was starting to freeze off there a little bit. So sorry if my voice is a little bit muffled now. Looks like we might have to cross some of the ice over here. Try not to get our feet all wet here. Seems to be fairly frozen over though. I mean, it is, what, 10 degrees or something outside. Make it? Okay. What was that? I said if you can make it across the ice, I can. Uh, she's calling me fat. <laughs>
at the green and orange intersection. We were gonna go all the way down the Candlewood Lake over there, but it looks like it's pretty steep and some of these areas are really rocky and the rocky and the snow don't really mix too well if you wanna actually have traction going down. So we're gonna head back this way and that'll take us back to the meadow area. So <laughs> I managed to freeze my camel back. I went to get a drink of water and it is completely frozen so hopefully it doesn't tear some of that plastic lining. We'll find out later. Now we're heading up more of the green trail. Just gotta keep on going. As happy trails would say, keep on trekking. And some crazy person took their bike through this area in the snow. Okay, maybe not crazy, but a little bit more adventurous than I would be. Made it back to the meadow. Such a beautiful area. Definitely come and check this out, guys. Made it back to the parking lot, and it looks like there's actually quite a few people here now. How was the hike, Deanna? Yeah, just pretty good. Oh, get some hot chocolate. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed our little stroll through Bear Mountain Reservation in Connecticut. If you liked the video, hit the like button, subscribe if you want to see more videos like it. You can also check us out at dnsadventures.com. And as always, adventure on.